Hey all, Brad here with a uh, update on the uh, Sinistar self-test. So as many of you know, uh, I'll power this up. But this has got the original uh, SoundROM 9 in it and uh, for Sinistar with the speech board over here. And when you hit the test button, absolutely nothing happens. It has no effect. And uh, Cinemax, Max, uh, he and I have been working together on some projects. And he looked at the code and saw that there was a checksum error. So he corrected the checksum. And lo and behold, we got a uh, sound test back. However, uh, the sound test only tested the D to A converter sound on the main board, kind of like, you know, Joust and Robotron uh, Stargate does. So it, I said it'd be really great if we could trigger some of the sounds on the speech board um, because sometimes, uh, you know, there's issues here that you still get the primary sounds, but the speech may be out. So he went through and, and made uh, a custom routine. There was plenty of space on the ROM. It doesn't affect the normal code when you're playing the game. It's only in the test mode. So I'll turn it on here. You saw you hit the button, nothing with the normal ROM. I will pop the original one out. Same IC2532, which is a 4K uh, EEPROM. I'm going to plug in the new one. I've got a custom or a reproduction label I'll put on there for that. So I power it up. And then when we hit the test button, you'll first hear the sound play a board, uh, sound off the D to A, off the primary board. And then it'll, it goes through and plays all the speech sounds. <laughs> So it just loops through and uh, continues playing until you cycle power, pull the, you know, pull the header off for power. Um, so uh, I plan on offering this up. I'll program it with the custom. Uh, again, this is one of the labels here. The reproduction looks exactly like uh, the original ones. Uh, we'll offer that guy up if you want to modify uh, your game, which I think is great for troubleshooting. If you're having a problem with the sound, you just can hit the button and know right away if the... Because, uh, again, this, this board is completely independent of the other boards. It's got its own CPU. It's basically its own computer system. So as long as you've got power coming in, a speaker and a volume pot, uh, if you press this button, you should get sounds regardless of the uh, other game board. So...